Hello there, this is Yogi Virendra Yogi. Beloved friends, you can see that we are in the forest. And here anything can happen because hardly we'll find some birds, beast animals and plants. You'll see some dogs here, you will see some kind of different beasts in the forest. But I dare to move around here. This is a place called Nani City in the heart of Bibinagar Mandal which is in Yajade district of Telangana state of India, beloved friends. Recently there was a murder here, right here. Somebody was murdered and uh, burned to death. But friends, I am fearless man. I move around here anytime, every time, and I claim myself to be the chief constable of Nani city. The city was developed by Colonel Rangarao, a retired military commander, and he did a wonderful job. This area is spread over 25 square kilometers. There is no end to it. And nobody stays here. These lands are plotted, but and so many places are reserved by the forest department, by the Bhutan movements, and so many other owners of this land are here. So nobody comes here. Then this is my kingdom. Virendra Yogi is the monarch of this place. I keep on moving around everywhere. There are a lot of criminals, murderers. But see, I am fearless. And you can ask why you are fearless, because I know the truth. I know that we are going to die one day and as long as we are following the path of dharma, the path of truth, justice, peace, love and non-violence, if you love everyone, birds, beasts, animals, plants, you don't ha hurt the sentiments of anyone, including birds, beasts, animals, plants, you are harmless, you are innocent, you are profound like Buddha and Vivekananda, all will become a follower. You know the story, when Buddha heard that there was a criminal giant who was killing human beings here and there everywhere in the forest. Then he started moving towards that. People told, don't go, don't go. The robber will kill you, cut to you pieces and put the finger in his garland. He smiled and he walked through that because he was following the path of truth, justice, peace, love and non-violence. This is more powerful than a wicked man who is a criminal. Criminals are weaker. Their foundation is greed, anger, hatred, jealousy, cynicism. These people cannot overpower Truth, justice, peace, love and non-violence. Because that is the absolute power of the universe. Universe justice. Justice is done to the universe. That is called the law of karma. That is called the law of compensation. That is called the law of sowing and reaping. I believe firmly in that. I am disciple of Buddha, Vivekananda, anybody who is the wiser on this earth. That should be the message to all of you, my beloved viewers. Follow the path of dharma. Be fearless. Try to understand the truth. Truth is we are born, we'll die one day. But don't die in between your birth and death. You will die once you are deviating from the path of dharma. That is you become greedy, you become angry, you are jealous, you are creating enmity, you hate people and all become your enemies. This yogi, Virendra yogi, profound Buddha, he has no fear. When Buddha was passing through the jungle, that demon, a human being, a robber, a terror criminal, he saw Buddha from the top of a tree. And he challenged Buddha, Hey, you are not afraid. Your death is very near because I am going to kill you and cut your finger and put in my garland. I enjoy when you fear. I enjoy seeing you in a very scaring mood of a state of mind. But Buddha was smiling because he was a man who follows all the pure path. Purity is more powerful than impurity. Love is more powerful than hatred. Love is ocean. Few drops of her hatred cannot pollute the whole ocean. Today the world is violent. They are hating each other, they are killing each other, they are all criminals. Sin, sin, sin. Other day one political leader from India is telling, cut the heads, cut the hands, cut the legs. These villain hatred people are our politicians. Because they have nothing to do, so they become politicians. Because India is a democracy where majority is illiterate, ignorant, they are sold few hundred rupees you give and they will give you vote. These criminals, they are timid. That is the attitude of the people. But this yogi, Virendra Yogi, and his best friend, Dr. Satnarayana, we are divine. We love people. We care for people. My friend, Dr. Satnarayana, he treats every person who is having some elements out of free, out of affection and love. So, dear friends, if you want to be fearless, try to understand the truth. Then what happened to the Buddha story? The man came, Buddha is still smiling. And they told, stop, you are going to be killed soon. Buddha walked. 
and then he stopped, paused and said, I stop because I obey you. When you are going to stop the villain, sound of Buddha was louder than the sound of the robber. He starts severing the robber because nobody dared to speak before him. So I tell you, if you don't accept slavery, if you don't accept fear, nobody is going to frighten you. Don't worry for death. This is inevitable. This earth is a place where people are born. They will control the journey of life and they are going to die one day. But don't die before that. Your real death is only once. That's why my best friend, Shakespeare said, the cowards die many times in their life, but the valiant test of death was once. Be fearless. Follow the path of truth, justice, peace, love and non-violence. Love everyone. Care for everyone. Become Buddha. Become Jesus. Become any great human being. My best friend Abraham Lincoln. My best guru, Buddha and Vivekananda. Victory to you. Victory to you at all fronts. Om Shanti. Om Shanti. Om Shanti. Thank you. My videographer is Honorable Dr. Satnarayan, a great medical practitioner of India. A famous physician and a philanthropic, great, large-hearted, loving human being. Dr. Satnarayan, sir, thank you very much. And my viewers, thank you very much.